Hello YouTube, in this video I'm going to show you how to perform the Polish finger trick for doing the sledgehammer on the cube. So you all know what the sledgehammer is and this finger trick is a way of doing the sledgehammer quickly in one movement like this. Oops. Like that. So it can be quite fast. And you can use it to solve whenever you have a sledgehammer case, or it can be also very useful for you perm. Um, personally, I am able to sub one U perms using this finger trick, and I think that um, it's much faster than just doing that because it's one movement and you don't have to re grip as much. Now, <clears throat> um, to perform this, at the start, it looks like it can be very complicated, and it can be difficult, but it's not that difficult once you know how. So the first thing um, that you'd probably think how to do it would be like, you put your hand like this, and then you go around, and then you try to bring this back with your thumb or something, but that is not how I do it, because you really lock up. So what I do is I really use my ring finger. Um, you really don't, you don't see when I do that, but it helps a lot. So what I do is I start, I have my ring finger here and the rest of my hand like this. So I'm gonna, I move this way and then I'm gonna push this way like this and I'm gonna push with my ring finger a little as well at the same time. And now I'm gonna push with my thumb but I'm gonna let my ring finger guide it to go back like that. And the same thing with the other direction. I'm gonna move with my thumb but I'm also gonna make sure that the layer is properly aligned and everything with my ring finger, like that. So once again, I start with my ring finger here, and like this, go like that, like that. And the goal of this is not only to do it quickly, but to try to make your hands move the less possible, so that you can be the most efficient possible, and in the end, do it faster. Um, some people have an issue with re-gripping, but if you're able to move your hand um, as little as possible, then you shouldn't have too much of an issue, because it wouldn't have moved so much. So that's pretty much it for the Polish finger trick. Just go like this. Make sure that you let your ring finger guide your moves and go around. And you gotta be careful when you get here, sometimes you try to um, move too quickly, but you've gotta really be careful um, so you don't lock up and let everything pass in its own time. Like that, there, I tried to come back a little too quickly, gotta lock up, gotta be careful. Um, that's about it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it and hope that it'll help speed up your skew times. So, thank you for watching.